Welcome into the recap of the Cubs. 8-2 pounding of the Minnesota Twins. Take two of three in the series. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by our great partners at Wintrust, the exclusive home of Cubs checking. Get that super cool Cubs checking account, that super sweet Cubs debit card that comes with it. Scan the QR code on your screen or go to Wintrust.com slash Cubs for all the details. Cubs take two of three. They actually look like a really good team over the last week or so. Can they tease us? Can they stay in the race and maybe grab a wild card spot? Arizona did it last year. The Phillies did it the year before. And me being the sucker Cubs fan that I am, like all of you that watch this, I still believe in them. I still pay attention. I'm tracking the game today, and I'm looking and going, huh, home run for Hap, home run for Michael Bush. Four more shutout innings from the bullpen. Javier Assad, 75 pitches in four innings, gave up two runs. And the Cubs played really, really good baseball. Our player of the game brought to you by the Chicagoland Chevy Dealers. I'm going to give it to the bullpen. Do you realize over the last 65 or 70 days, the Cubs are top three in every metric that you look at to grade a bullpen? Top three, and yet they've blown 21 saves. Imagine where they'd be. 15 of those turned into losses. Imagine if you'd won seven more games. You'd be a playoff team. You'd be right in the race in the NL Central. Cubs beat the Twins. Day off tomorrow, and then they get the White Sox on Friday. Friday, Saturday, rare Sunday off. White Sox snap their losing streak. We'll see what happens on Friday. Enjoy the rest of your day. Enjoy the uh, day off tomorrow. Take that.